MCTV is on the air. Standing by live at our Mifflin County Television Studios, here's your MCTV anchor team. Good morrow, thou Huskies. Today is Thursday, March 5th, and day two of the six-day cycle. Please rise for the national anthem and pledge to the flag. Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Concert choir lessons today are Period 1, Jorge Natal Period 2, Lizzie Miller, Regan Gilbert, Lydia Angst Period 3, Brianna Borman Period 4, Paige Putt, Abby Davis Period 5, Emily Zilstra. As you probably noticed when you came in this morning, now through March 20th, there will be a table set up in the main lobby from 7.30 to 8 a.m. A senior student is collecting new toothbrushes and taking donations for a senior project to promote a healthy smile. These toothbrushes will go to local families in need. Make a donation and get a treat. Attention students, you can no longer order a personalized yearbook. An updated order form is now available. If you have an order form and didn't get it this week, it's obsolete. Pick up the current form in the main office or outside rooms A207 and A322. See Mrs. Ryden in room A322 for questions. Attention all students and staff. This week we are registering students to participate in the MCHS Mini-Thon. The best time to register this week will be tomorrow. Make sure you tune in to find out all you need to know about Thon. Please join the fight against childhood cancer. Prom tickets will be on sale during all lunches starting today through Friday, April 3rd. All class dues must be paid in order to purchase tickets. If you are bringing in guests from another school, you must fill out a guest permission form. Tickets are $25 for singles and $50 for couples. Stacy Miller Portrait Design will be at the prom to take professional pictures this year. Prices and packages are affordable for everyone. Forms will be available when prom tickets are on sale in the cafeteria. Be sure to pick one up when you purchase your tickets. In your first period, there are plastic shoe boxes. We are asking you to help us fill them with new toys for the Jared Box Foundation. There is a list of suggested toys and what can't be brought in. Your first period can decide if you want your box to be for a boy or girl. We will be collecting boxes on Friday, March 27th. Contact Kylie Rank or Whitney Harshberger with any questions. Attention Stuco. Our annual field trip to the Altoona Curve baseball game is Wednesday, April 29th. Please let Mrs. Zagner and Ms. Gallo know by the end of the day Friday if you are planning to go. Money will not be due until April. Attention all art club members. Art club will be going on a field trip to Baltimore, Maryland on April 8th and you are invited to come along. Permission forms and information sheets are available in all art rooms. Forms are due back no later than this coming Friday. Here's Zandra with sports. In MC Sports, all girls who try it out for softball should report for practice right after school today. That's a quick look at sports. Gabby, what's for lunch? 
In the Husky line, oven roasted chicken with roll, mashed potatoes with gravy, steamed broccoli, and milk. And in the griller, cheeseburger or grilled chicken sandwich, and it's salad bar Thursday. Gabby has one final announcement. The Culinary 2 and CAD students are at it again, making crazy displays for this year's MCHS Cupcake Wars. Tomorrow is voting day and all faculty, students, and classes are invited to come down to the culinary art rooms throughout the day to sneak a peek at the Cupcake War creations and vote for the best display. So be sure to stop by B114 tomorrow and vote. That's all for the morning show. I'm Adam. And I'm Gabby. Have a great day. Have a husky day.